welcome to my youtube channel my name is rachel rabo i'm a power platform developer and a dynamics 365 crom developer today i'm going to be showing you how to set up a new repository and organization in azure devops don't forget to like this video and hit on the subscribe button so if you can notice i've signed into my azure account on portals.azure.com i'll be dropping the link in the description of, of this video so you can check that out and there's something essential that we need before we can set up our azure devops organization you need to make sure that you have a subscription before you can actually set up an organization so while looking at my screen you can see that i already have azure devops organization showing on my screen but just in case you do not have the same thing just go to the search bar and search for Azure DevOps. And you can see Azure DevOps organization. So just click on that. Then, well, okay, and let's do that again. Azure DevOps organization. So we're going to scroll down, then click on my Azure DevOps organizations. And then click on create new organizations. So I'm going to click on continue. So there's something I'm going to point, point you to in case if you are having any issues. You can check out this blog post on Microsoft Tech, and tele, tech Community on how to set up your account. So there are actually screenshots you can follow on how to set up your account. So I hope this helps you. I'm also going to be dropping the link in the description of this video. So let's go back. So I'm going to give this a name. So you can actually edit that. Okay, so let's just leave it like this. Then you have to choose your closest region. I'm going to be selecting West Europe. The Central US, North Europe, Southeast Asia, Brazil South, Canada Central, South Indian, and Australia East. So I'm going to be using West Europe. So the next thing to do is to enter the characters you see. So for me, this is the characters I'm seeing. So I'm just going to enter them and click on continue. Okay. So we're waiting for it to load to take us to our Azure DevOps organization. Okay, so there's something to notice when we get to this point is that you can make, you can actually make your projects either private or public. So if you want to make it private, you can just give your project a name and click on create project. But if you want to make it public, so what we are going to do, we are going to go to organization policies. So when we get to organization policies, so you can see, we're just going to get what we need to turn on, which is clicking on allow public projects. So we're just going to turn this on, then click on save. So after clicking on save, we're just going to go back and you see you have access to make your project public. And if you want to switch off this, if you want to also switch this off, you can also go through the same process to switch, to turn this to, from, to have only access to public. So we're just going to be using private. So I'm just going to name this YouTube video. And one thing to, to consider is that when naming your project, try to name it something that you remember that, okay, this is what this project is about to make it easier for you. So I'm just going to click on create project. Okay, perfect. So we have created our Azure DevOps organization. So the next thing we are going to do now is to actually create our repository. So in order to create our repository, I clicked on repos 
at the left side of the screen then i'm going to click on this plus sign then click on new repository so i'm going to give this repository a name i'm also going to give it okay then i'm going to look for visual studio so it depends on you what yeah you want to use you can see you have access to so many things you can use here but for me i'm going to be using visual studio code then i'm going to click on create okay so i hope this has helped you in order to create a new repository in your azure devops organization so don't forget to like this video and hit on the subscribe button see you in the next video